Good morning, everybody. I was worried we weren't going to have class today. <laughs> it was crazy down over here. We finally got it up and running. I'm doing a bunch of stuff from my phone. <laughs> it was chaos. <laughs> oh, fun times. Live and learn. Growth mindset and all that jazz. Oh, good golly, Miss Molly. All right, let's go ahead and get this guy up for you, friends. All right, comparing decimals is going up. So we're going to take attendance at 820. It's a quick lesson anyways. I always find that equivalent decimals and comparing decimals, it just tends to go smoothly. So at least we have that. We have Amplify access, at least a workaround to make that work. So you know what? There are some rays of sunshine on this fantastic, crazy Friday. So yes, I'm not going to worry. Everyone's being super understanding. So love you guys. Thank you. I don't like appearing like a chaotic mess. So yes, thank you, thank you, thank you. I've got some things rolling out for people. Thankfully, most of this stuff is like made the night before. So it's just a matter of updating and uploading. So, huh. <laughs> what a day. What a day. Alrighty, let's see. Let's go ahead. We'll do that. I heard DJ's making French toast. I'm jelly. I would love some. I will have virtual French toast with you, DJ. It's funny because, like, my grandma always had a phrase, ice cream can make everything better, so clearly today is an ice cream day. Alrighty, so I'm going to go ahead and turn on the stream. Alrighty. And then we'll let friends roll in. I've got a couple links that I have to send out to some people. Hello, Ollie. But let's all be thankful for Class Dojo, shall we? <laughs> Getting information out to parents. Yay! <laughs> All right, let's go see if we can retrieve some more friends. Hi, DJ. I heard you had French toast this morning, and you were a rock star and made some for your brother, too. You're such a champ. I'm jealous. I want some. Good morning, Micah. How's it going? Hi, Michaela. Nice. Good job, Devin. Very good. All right, so I'm just going to get this up. Alrighty, hello. It's delicious. Now, virtual French toast. Om um, nom 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 nom. Mm. <laughs> no joke though. Now I want French toast, DJ. I might actually have to make myself some after we're done here. <laughs> we'll call it uh, virtual French toast 2.0. So good you can taste it. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, good job, Jacob. Proud of you. We're talking about the houses this morning. I have it all set up. Oof. Yay. I'm going to give friends time to uh, roll in. Let's all just, you know, be thankful the internet works. I should show you what our internet looks like now and why it's so cuckoo pants. It looks like a dead spider that's upside down with its legs in the air. It has so many antennas coming off of it. It's crazy. I'm not even joking. It looks like a dead spider. I uh, yeah, Michaela high fives. Spiders are gross. Do you want to hear the craziest story since we're waiting on friends to roll in? Michaela, check this out. I was sitting in my chair the other day watching TV with my husband and my puppy dog, and I felt something crawling on my arm. It was a baby spider, and I squished it, and I was like, mm, okay, not a big deal. Then I felt another one, and then I felt another one, and then I started seeing little spiders coming from the ceiling, and I was like, oh my god, and I got up. And I walked away and my husband was like, what's wrong? Why are you spazzing out? I was like, there are baby spiders crawling on me. It's disgusting. And he's like, oh yeah, right. I said, no, look, there's one right now. It's crawling across my arm. And then I smashed it. Not even playing. I go to the bathroom because they're like coming from the ceiling, right? There's one on my head. I'm not like I have goosies. Look, I have goosies just talking about because I hate spiders so much. So yeah, between that and eating a bug yesterday and then the internet pooping out today, Guys, it's been a week. It's been a week. <laughs> I'm so glad the week's over. Yay for the weekend. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. <laughs> right, Michaela? Isn't that so gross? I still have goosies. Ugh. <laughs> I hate spiders so much. It's so gross. <laughs> I know, so yucky. Ugh. <laughs> ew, ew, ew. <laughs> All righty, let's see who we got. Good morning, Javier and Michaela. I got Jacob and DJ. I've got Aiden. Shelby, are you on? Shelby, are you on? I've got Ty, Audric, and Kaylee. I've got Guy. I know, right? So gross. I've got Guy Hamza. Ugh, Lexi, too true. Lexi and Sama got you. Good morning, Alexa. I've got Ray. I know I saw Ali and Aya and Ra Ra. I know I saw Zora. I've got Kira. Shelby, are you here yet? I've got Avery and Kian. Kalise, are you here yet? I saw Micah. 
looking for nails. I've got Faiz. There's Hanan. Got Devin and Tiana. Jenna, are you here? Hi, Khalees. We've got Ashley, Katrina, Khadijah, are you here? There you go. Hi, Nils. Hi, Avery. Hi, Khadija. So we'll get started in about three minutes. I wanted to give time for people to roll in. We got the link up late because my internet was being a stubborn child, which is always fun. So we'll give it two more minutes. We're waiting on a few friends. Two more minutes. Waiting on a few friends. because I'm trying to do too many things at once. You should see my station over here. It's crazy. Thank you, DJ. You did a good job. It makes me want French toast. <laughs> All right, one more minute, and we'll go ahead and take attendance. Thanks, everybody. Ew, Lexi. <laughs> that is gross. <laughs> wall of death of <laughs> Zalim. <laughs> Zalim, you're funny. All right, we'll give it like 30 more seconds. I got a few more friends. We'll see if they roll in. See, no water bottle now. I need to be able to see to make sure there's no bugs in it. I told my husband that I'm like super petrified of my water bottle now. Yep, no water bottle. All right, let's go ahead and take attendance. Let's put our academic hats on. Type OK if you're ready to rock. Fantastic. All right. Type hi or hello when you hear your name. Uh, RC sick. All right, here we go, babes. All right, I've got a Zaleem, Ali, Aya. I've got a Rara, a Zora, and an Aiden. I've got a Jacob, a Hamza, and a Ray. I've got a Shelby, an Avery, Khalees. 
Lexi, Michaela, and Sama. I've got Micah, Nils, Javier. I've got Faiz, Hanan, and Devin. I have Tiana, DJ, Jenna. I have Alexa, Josiah, Guy. I have RC, Ashley, and Khadija. Fantastic. Hello, everybody. Fantastic. All right, let's get into it, shall we? So at this point in the day, my guess is you have your reflex math green light. Fantastic. Your flip grid is called curiouser and curiouser. What you're going to do is you're going to give me details about research you're doing. on your first question. So at this point, you should have three questions for your discovery quest. You're doing research on one. You're giving me a couple facts of what you found. Prodigy is 20 minutes. Plan for about 30 minutes. If you want the infinity tower, you just have to let me know. I just have to put up an assignment and it opens it up. And then we're in math right now. Yay. You're going to have a comparing decimals activity. Read aloud is also up. And then we'll do literacy at 1015 and science at 110. Any questions? Fantastic. All right, let's go ahead and look at your Hogwarts houses, shall we? All righty, so my fifth graders, you stayed put. If you're at the top, it means you're the captain of your team. If you are at the top, it means that you are the captain of your team. So Gryffindor. Oh, I left the... the trophies up from last time. Ignore the trophies. All right, so I've got Kira, DJ, Guy, Aya, Audric, Devin, Hamza, Avery, and Javier as part of Gryffindor, Slytherin. I've got Zalim, Jenna, Rara, Khadija, Kian, Lexi, Ty, Kaylee, and RC. On Ravenclaw's team, I've got Aiden, Ray, Ali, Faiz, Shelby, Zora, Michaela, Nils, and Alexa. In Hufflepuff, I've got Jacob, Ashley, Katrina, Tiana, Khalees, Sama, Hanan, Josiah, and Micah. So again, my fifth graders, you stayed on the same team. And if you're at the top of the list, it means that you are the captain of your team. You are responsible to a degree for helping your friends figure out how to turn assignments in to get the most points. Now, whether or not... Whether or not the stick, we'll see. I have to kind of see how points go. And it sounds like Khalees really wants Slytherin, so Khalees may be going to Slytherin. I'll put RC over in Hufflepuff. So I will say it's an equal opportunity for points. Meaning that the kids are distributed based on work. So that way, everyone's got an equal opportunity for points. So like I said, we'll see what happens. I'll probably switch a few friends down, uh, around. And I also don't know if I'm sticking with Hogwarts houses. I might go Ilvermorny houses. So we'll see. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to talk about daily trifecta. Daily trifecta means... There we go. Got concerned for a second. You get bonus points
So you get a plus one bonus for turning in all work before 8 p.m. So you get a plus one bonus point for turning in all work before 8 p.m. Yeah, Jacob was a rock star. Essentially, anyone who was at the top was a rock star last year and turning in all of their work be well before 8 o'clock. Captains will switch depending on work and when it's turned in. Okay, so how to earn points. So you get points by turning in work. It's a plus one for every assignment. So plus one before for every assignment. So if you figure math, literacy, science, or social studies, that's three points right there. Read aloud, prodigy, reflex, flipgrid. So that's seven total points per day. Okay, coming to the live stream. Plus one for every session. So that is a possible three points per day. Yeah, the whole team has to work hard. So turning in music before 8 p.m. So you have to get the music in beforehand. So beforehand. So that's a plus one. Okay, bonus points, Flipgrid, if your Flipgrid is professional, well done, prompts answered, and you're a role model for others, you can get one point per Flipgrid a day. I usually try and pick three kids a day for Flipgrid. So whoever has like the three best, I usually give an extra point. Or like if I'm really impressed with what you've done. So like if I was to look at it, like Michaela's been doing amazing work. And so I would give her an extra point because her flip grids are like role model S, they go above and beyond. That's essentially what I'm looking for to get that point in Flipgrid is are you going above and beyond or are you doing the bare minimum? If 
Right. I give stars on Flipgrid. So if you're going above and beyond, I will star you and you will know you get the point that way. So if I give you a star, you get the point. Okay, so Prodigy Fridays. Prodigy Fridays. Whoever is first, second, and third place by Friday morning. First place gets three points, second place gets two points, and third place gets one bonus point for their team. I usually star on Flipgrid like three people. I kind of treat it like first, second, and third place, but everyone gets the same amount of points. Okay, any questions for points? Eeps, go back. Where'd it go? There we go. Any questions on points? Anything I missed? I think I got everything. Okay. Possible rewards. Here's what we did last year. Last year we would do Roblox parties. Either Friday or on the weekend. Aw, Gee, we're gonna miss you. I'm bummed. That makes me sad. All right, so Roblox parties. We were doing Skype, uh, well, not Skype parties, Zoom parties. With games. And then I was thinking of possibly doing movie nights. Are there any rewards you can think of that we could do that I missed? Reflex goes into assignments. So are there any rewards that you can think about that we have missed? Oh, okay. All right, if you think of anything, let me know. I'm, I'm up for ideas. So this is what we'll do. Okay. Hi, Khadijah, no worries. All right, so let's go to your table of contents. Let's go to your table of contents. Today we're going to day four, day four, comparing decimals going on page 21. So comparing decimals, page 21. Give me an okay when you are ready. Give me an okay when you are ready.
Give it a couple more minutes. Thank you, Khadijah, Guy, Tiana, Lexi. Thank you, Michaela, Ashley, Ali. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, everybody. All righty. I'm going to put in some paper. There we go. Come on down. Day four? Day four. Comparing and ordering decimals. Today is the 25th. And then objective So today we will use place value to compare numbers with values up through the thousands place. Uh, Zalim, that's Khadijah. Give me a text emoji when you are ready. Give me a text emoji when you are ready. All righty. So let's go ahead. If you have printed off the notes, that's cool. Totally fine. You'll have something that looks like this. So you'll just be filling in. However, for those of you who cannot print, also totally fine. We're just going to write it out. So fret not, my dudes. Fret not. All right. So let's go ahead and get into it. We are going to be comparing decimals. I like to call this mathematical. Connect the dots. So I like to call this mathematical connect the dots. All right, so let's say I've got 57 and 84 hundredths, and I want to compare it with 57 and 81 hundredths, okay? So the first thing I want to do 
So the first thing I want to do is I want to line up the numbers. based on place value. And I'm going to do that by lining up the decimals. So I'm going to do 57 and 84 hundredths and then 57 and 81 hundredths. Here's where your connect the dots come in. I should be able to draw a line through your dots, like you're connecting them. So connect the dots. Any questions on how to line up the decimals? Any questions on how to line up the decimals? I mean, it's pretty straightforward, right? You play connect the dots, draw a straight line. <laughs> That's why I argue that the decimals are actually easier than the whole numbers because the whole numbers can get confusing. But as long as you're lining up the decimals, everything else kind of falls into place. Okay. Two. Start with the largest place value. So start with the largest place value and compare. If they're the same, cross them out. If they're the same, cross them out. If they're different, compare that place value. Ray highlighters are going to be helpful here. So again, I've got 57, and I'll make that bigger. I've got 57 and 84 hundredths. I've got 57 and 81 hundredths. I've lined up my decimals. And now I'm going to compare. So I'll start here. Start the largest place value. Okay. Is this place value the same or different? Are the numbers the same in both or are they different? Are they the same or are they different? Same. Yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and cross them out. Same numbers I cross out. Okay, so now we look at the next column. Move to the ones. Are they the same or are they different? Good job, Guy. Muy bien. Very good. Good job, Khadija. Cross them out. Good job, Holly. Yes, we cross them out. Good job. Okay, move to the tenths column. Okay, we're going to move to the tenths column. Same or different? 
Tenths column. Same or different. Tenths column. Same or different. Good job. Yep, so we cross them out. Hundredths column. Same or different. Hundredths column, same or different. Hundredths column, same or different. Not the same. Very good. So once we identify, whoops, need more paper. Ah, where's my paper? There we go. Okay, so once we discover So three, so three, once you find the place value, with different values, compare the numbers. So now I'm going to compare 4 and 1. Which number will the monster Which number will the monster eat? Om nom nom. Which number will the monster eat? Ah, gi muy bien, yes. Remember, the monster is hungry and wants to eat the bigger number. See, si, very good. Om nom 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 nom. So that means that 57 and 84 hundredths is larger, um, nom, 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 than 57 and 81 hundredths. This means that 0 and 0, 04 is larger than 0 and 0, 1 hundredths. Um, nom, 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 um, nom, 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 nom. Questions? Cool. All right, let's try some problems then, shall we? Let's try it. I think so? I can't remember. All right, so let's say I've got 124 and 78 hundredths compared to 124 and 67 hundredths. First step is, first step is, what do I need to do first? What do I need to do first? Zalim, sure. You can write the practice problems. That's fine. 
Just make sure you are showing your work. Line up the numbers. Yes, we play connect the dots. So line up the numbers. 124 and 78 hundredths. 124 and 67 hundredths. I know I am correct because do, 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 I can line up my decimals. Now what can I do next? Compare the largest numbers. So I go here first. And I ask myself, same or different? I ask myself, same or different? And I go, ooh, those are the same. Boom, 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 boom. Go to the next column. And I ask myself, same or different? Ha ha, Ollie. And I go, ooh, ooh, those are the same. Cross those out. Then I go to the next one. And I go, hey, are these the same or are they different? And I go, ooh, 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 they're the same. So I cross them out. Boom, boom. Good job, Gee. Ha ha, Ollie. <laughs> All right, then I go to the next column. What is the name of the place value where the numbers are different first? So what's the name of this place value? What's the name of the place value? The tenths column. Michaela, great. Ray, good job. Not same. Good job, Guy. Zaline, very good. I agree. So yes, so we're comparing. Just kidding. Seven tenths to six tenths. Who is bigger? Seven tenths or six tenths? Who is bigger? Good job, Zora. Yes, DJ. High five, very good. Yes. Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Get my monster. Om nom 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 nom. Om nom 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 nom. Delicious. And so now I come up here to my number and I do the same thing. Good job. Shall we do one more? Sure, indeed. All right, good tood. Here we go. I have 34 and 82 hundredths compared to 34 and 802 thousandths. What do I do first? What do I do first? Line it up. Line it up, up, up. Line it up, up, up. Always makes me think of that Fall Out Boy song. So line them up. Uh-oh. I have an issue. What do I do for the blank spot? I have an issue. What do I do for the blank spot? Nope, simplifying is in fractions. Good try though. I have a blank spot. What do I, Guy muy bien, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Add a zero. Do you remember what that's called when you add a zero? What's the fancy word? Do you remember? Need a zero? Annex one in. 
This means add a zero, create an equivalent. Annex a zero. When in doubt, annex a zero. All right, here we go. Same or different. Same or different. Yep, cross them out. Move to the next place value. Okay, same or different. Same or different, what do I do? Same or different, what do I do? Same. And if they're the same, we cross them out. We cross them out. Okay, move down to the tenths. Same or diff. Same or different. Same or different. Same or different. Yeah, cross them out. Eliminate. Meow, 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 meow. Eliminate. This is Sparta. <laughs> That's funny, Ray. Cross them out. That's when uh, Ollie needs to do his cross swords after, after this is Sparta. <laughs> Ollie's coming in with the funny emojis. This is hysterical. Alrighty. Alright. What's the name of the place value where the numbers are different first? Sparta. No, you can't Sparta this. <laughs> you can't do that here. Different. Let's compare. Here we go. <laughs> I got a two. Technically, it's a hundredth. And then I've got a nothing. No X. No X. We must om nom nom or om nom nom. Where shall we send our monster? <laughs> He's got a crocodile in the chat and it's eating. <laughs> That's funny. It's the wrong. I can't, it would work if the two is on that side. Yes, two hundredths is greater than nothing. So we're going to have the crocodile eat. <laughs> um, nom, 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 nom. That's funny. <laughs> That only works, though, if it's this way. That's funny. <laughs> yeah, that way. <laughs> that was hilarious. Okay. Okay, any questions or are you guys good to go? Yes, we'll do one more because I know you guys are having a field day with the emojis. It's pretty funny. Okay, so Aya, we get the answer because we're comparing here in the two is bigger than nothing so we're here so this one's going to be the one that gets eaten ha jacob you're using sharks <laughs> it's math with emojis <laughs> i love it all right we'll do one more <laughs> it's 
mathematics shark do 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 mathematics shark do 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 mathematical shark do 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 comparing shark comparing shark do 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 comparing shark do 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 that's hilarious i'm glad you guys are enjoying it <laughs> all right well let's throw this in let's do three and three tenths compared to three and three ninths First thing I do is what? <laughs> line it up, 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 line it up, 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 line it up, up, up. We're doing math. <laughs> okay, so let's line it up. Ignore Miss Young's horrible singing voice. Line them up. Who knew? Who knew? There's a problem. Who knew? Uh oh. What do we do? I see a problem. Who knew? What do we do? I see a problem. Yes! And what's the name of the word? Pinkies up. What's the fancy term? You gotta annex that zero. Got to annex that zero. Make it fancy. Ooh. All right, let's compare. Go to the ones. What do I do? Same or different? Same or different? Good job. Exit out. Yeah. Exit out. Meow, 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 meow. Okay, head down to the tenths place. Okay, in the tenths. Same or different in the tenths. Same or different in the tenths. Oh, good job, Javier. Javier for the win. Coming in strong. Same again. Same again. And what do we do? We cross them out. So here we go. Cross them out. Pew, 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 pew. Lightsabers coming in. Little X-wings. Okay, last one. Same or different? Same or different? What do we do here? What do we do here? My hundreds place. Ooh, ooh, we have different numbers. Okay. So zero versus nine careful where you put your numbers when using your emojis make sure you are eating the bigger number make sure you're eating the bigger number There you go. Yes, Michaela. Yes, Ashley. Good job, good job, good job. Good job, good job, good job. This, it's emoji comparison. I love it. Yes, I am very good. Get that, Lexi. Get that, Dino. Yeah. Good job, Ali. Good job, Guy, with the pizza. Yes, Khadija, having fun with the emojis. Hold on. I'm going to take a picture of this. This is hilarious. This is going up on our class dojo page. All right. That's funny. I love it. I love it so much. It's math with emojis. <laughs> okay. Math attack. Om nom 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 nom. Math attack. Om nom 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 nom. <laughs> Ashley, are you using a shrimp? <laughs> oh, go 
good gravy. Oh my gosh. I love it so much. This is hilarious. I love, 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 love it. You want one more? One more? Okay, we'll do one more. Just because we're having fun. <laughs> it's fun with comparisons. All right, one more. Do you want a hard one? Do you want a hard one? I will give you a hard one. Yes. Let's go. Yes. Okay, here we go. Three and 45 hundredths. Three and 46. 461 thousandths. Three and 54. Three numbers. Three numbers. Oh, snap. Go, oh, snap. Three numbers. What do I do? Yes. Sing your Fall Out Boy math song. I line it up, 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 line it up, 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 line it up, up, up. We are comparing. All right, here we go. So same process with three. Three and forty-five hundredths. Three and four hundred sixty-one thousandths. Three and fifty-four hundredths. And we line it up. Pew, 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 noom, 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 noom. Uh-oh. I have a problem. Uh-oh. I have a problem. What do I do? What do I do? I have a problem. What do I do? Ah! I bet you. <laughs> you gotta annex twice. What? You gotta annex twice. Yes. Annex a zero, annex a zero, pinky up, annex a zero. And there's two spots, so you got to annex twice. Annex twice. Okay. Let's compare. One's column. One's column. Same or different. Same or different. Same or different. I know, Alexa, isn't it fun? Same. So what do we do for same? What do we do for same? It's a Twix. Alex Alexi, it's a Twix. Yeah, I'll annex it twice. Twix it. Sparta. <laughs> All right, Sparta this. Pew, 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 pew. We're Darth Mauling it with dual lifesavers. All right, so next column. What numbers get X'd out? What numbers get X'd out? Good job, Micah. We're going to compare this one. <laughs> Gotta eat them all, Pokemon. <laughs> I love it. Yes, let's go ahead and cross out that four. Leaving the five behind. So that's going to be our largest number right here. Fours aren't worthy. Cross them out. <laughs> that's hysterical. I love it. Okay, next one. Okay, what do I do here? So now I've got a five and a six. Now I've got a five and a six. What do I do? What do I do? I feel like I have to sing the Jeopardy song. Do, 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 Okay, compare it. Compare it. Make sure that your emojis are being used appropriately, though. Yes, gee, yes. It om nom noms the six. 
I'm nom 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 nom. Delicious. <laughs> I like that Ashley's using shrimps. <laughs> That's really funny. <laughs> oh, fun times. I like that Ashley's using shrimp. <laughs> So yeah, so now we're going to come in. Now I compare all three. We said our largest one was 3 and 54 hundredths is larger than 3 and 46 hundredths is larger than 3 and 45 hundredths. <laughs> Michaela's using unicorns. <laughs> That's awesome. All right. Good job, friends. Everyone's brain's on fire. I love it. Good job, Josiah. Very nice. All right. So let's take a look at your work, shall we? So it's got a little bit of a review. Little bit of a review. Little bit of a review. And you should just be able to click and it should let you in. Okay, and then you're going to identify the value. Aw, oh, shucks, guys, you're making me happy. And then compare. And then for these, it's just a drag and drop. So you'll click, drag, drop. Okay? Click, drag, drop. Click, drag, drop. And then it's just putting them in order from least to greatest. Make sure, though, that you're paying attention to what direction you go. Order the months from least to greatest, which means that least to greatest Smallest amount, largest amount. Okay, largest amount, smallest amount. Fun in class with me. Huzzah! Okay. Aw, Ashley, you're so sweet. I appreciate that. All right, so. Go off into the great unknown and go do some math. Um, nom, 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 nom. And I will see you at 10, 15. 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 This is Sparta. <laughs> I love it so much. It's so funny. You guys are hysterical. I love it. I love it. I love it. Bye, friends. 10-15. Go eat some numbers. Bye, guys. Go eat some numbers. <laughs>